Embroiled in four different court battles, Ed Jew is getting used to this. Hey, how are you? Greeting reporters like old friends, he walked into the courthouse, now suspended from his official duties and suddenly with a lot of spare time. How has life been for you? It's fantastic. Yeah, fantastic. What are you doing fantastic. with your time? I think I'm a pretty good teacher. My daughter says that. <laughs> staying at home with your kids, family? Well, I'm a, my, my cooking has improved a lot. But as for his legal troubles, Jew referred all comment to this man. Stuart Hanlon is the suspended city supervisor's new lawyer. He's replacing Bill Fazio, who had a falling out with Jew a couple of weeks ago. Hanlon's had a long career in San Francisco. He's defended Black Panthers, music legends, and the couple convicted of kidnapping Patty Hearst. My family three, uh Hanlon's taking over just one of Ed Jew's legal battles. It's the felony charges of lying about where he lived to run for office. Good morning, Your Honor. Evan Akron for the people. Good morning, Your Honor. Stuart Hanlon with Mr. Jew. And from now till the trial, he'll be doing a lot of reading. 9,000 pages really isn't that much. I mean, it's a complex case, but it's, it's a case about, you know, the issues of where he lived and where he intended to live. Intended, that's the word Hanlon will use to defend Mr. Jew, who's admitted he spent most of his nights at a house in Burlingame while calling San Francisco his home. This case is just one slice of the legal pie that's been thrown in Ed Jew's face. A different lawyer is defending him against federal charges he shook down local businesses for money, and more questions about where he lived before the city's ethics commission and in a lawsuit by the city attorney that could permanently remove Jew from office. With an interim supervisor already serving in his place. Jew's new lawyer wants those cases to wait. He's suspended. They have a supervisor. What's the big deal? You know, there's no rush here. But the city was moving full speed ahead until they hit a roadblock. Crawford Force Teresa Estacio has more on that.